Good morning, everybody. We're at Walgreens, new week. Today starts the new month for Walgreens and lots of great deals. Olay this week, buy two, get $4 in Walgreens cash and they'll be priced at $7 each. That's $14 for the pair, the bar soap is included. We have a $5 off of two digital. That'll bring our price down to $9. That's what we'll pay out of pocket. And then we'll get back $4 on Walgreens cash when you buy two. You can roll Walgreens cash to purchase or register rewards from previous. I was looking deals. at the online deal in store, you get $4 store rewards. So I'm not sure if it's the store rewards or cash rewards on the Olay, but you get $4 back. The Dollar Shave Club this week, no deal, but if you pick up two of the shaving gels at $5.99, that's $11.98. We do have a $6.99 digital off of two. That'll bring your total down to $4.98. And some of you might even have fetch offers. I do not. For the Gillette Lab deal, we have spend $25, get a $10 in Walgreens cash. We do have an $8 off of one digital if you haven't used it. And for the shaving cream, $7.99. You can pair together the razor at $6.99 if your store has it, and a shaving gel at $7.99. There is a $2 digital, Gillette digital, that expires today that is attaching to that. If you pick up this Gillette Lab shaving gel, that's $9.99 plus the $16.99 razor, that'll be $26.98. You're at your $25 mark, $10 in digital, you'll pay $16.98, getting back um, $10 in Walgreens cash. Final price, $6.98 for the pair, if you have that $16.99 razor. Our Purex products are on sale for $3.79 this week. We have a dollar digital for either the packs or the detergent, and then we have a separate dollar digital for the Purex crystals. Welcome Pick up two. $3.79, deducting two $1 digitals, $5.58 for the pair. For the Purex detergent, here we go, $3.79 each. There's our dollar digital, subtotal is $5.58, $6.21 after tax, used $5 in Walgreens cash, paid $1.21. Let's hope we get a rebate on our bottle this week. The Tom's and Main deodorant on sale this week for $4.99. We do have a dollar digital that'll bring that down to $3.99 and then we'll get $3 in Walgreens cash. Final price, 99 cents after Walgreens cash back. For the Tom Main's deodorant, here's their receipt, $4.99. There's our dollar digital. Paid $4 in Walgreens cash, 40 cents is what came out of my pocket after tax. The Tide Simply products are on sale for, for nine again. My store is out of the pods and the 60 count dryer sheets but there are 50 cents digitals for the detergent and the pods and a 50 cents coupon for the dryer sheets if you have it so just keep in mind my store is out so i'm gonna pass on the deal right now i'll do it later on in the week at another store don't forget this week arm and hammer products i buy one get one free and at my store they're priced at 749 so that's what you'll pay for the pair 749 just choose two of the products for our scott toilet paper and paper towels this week they're originally five dollars we have a dollar 25 off digital that we can use it will attach to both bringing them down to 375 or 750 for the pair for the cotton nail this week ten dollars not giving back anything no rewards I ha i'm gonna use this 20 percent off of a ten dollar purchase along with the four dollar off of two digital the 20% off of $10 will take off $4 off of two packs, $2 off of each. The balance that'll be left $12 and I'll just pay that out of pocket for 12 for two packs of cotton nail priced at $10. For the cotton nail y'all, it did not work out like I thought it was. Here's my receipt, $20 for the pair. The 20% off of a $10 purchase, $4. No digital coupon. That just left my subtotal $16 plus the tax. I used Walgreens cash. I'm gonna have to call um, Walgreens customer service today to get my $4 because I desperately like this toilet paper. Okay, I'm over by the allergy medicine and most of the allergy medicine is when you buy two, you're gonna get a $5 registry reward. Well, I picked up the Allegra 70 count tabs on sale for $36.99. It says we have an $8 digital, but the, you know how sometimes the coupons are not attaching to the app? Well, right now the coupons are not attaching when you scan the product. 
but it says eight dollar coupon there are some other coupons so we'll have to see what happens at the register but we also have a ten dollar rebate on ibotta back um the timer is attached so you know it's ticking down plus we have that spend 30 get ten dollars in cash rewards back on any allergy medicine and i'm gonna pair that with my spend 40 get 20 dollars in cash rewards back and i have a paper booster spend 50 get 10 dollars in rewards back so let's see what happens. here's everything i'm picking up for my deal now i'll be using my spend 50 get 10 dollars paper booster for this deal spend 40 20 dollars and cash rewards back a digital booster spend 30 on allergy getting back ten dollars in walgreens cash altogether that'll be forty dollars in walgreens cash i'll receive back for this deal my total is fifty dollars and 99 cents i have a five dollar off of two digital for the olay and hopefully an eight dollar digital for the allegra paired with my $14 in registry rewards. And remember, the registry rewards are not attaching to anything, so you don't need a filler item. That should bring me down to $23.99, getting back $40 in Walgreens cash for paper and digital boosters, nothing back on the Allegra because I didn't buy two, and a $4 registry reward for the Olay. But I am getting back $10 on Ibotta for that Allegra. So let's get ready to go check out. This should end up being a $14 moneymaker if everything works out. Okay, so here's how I went for my Allegra and Olay deal. I'm so sorry about my camera, y'all. I'm definitely gonna take it to get it fixed, but I have a feeling they're gonna tell me I need a new phone. Here's my receipt, $36.99, and then um, $14 for the Olay. There's my paper booster my five off of two digital at the bottom for the Olay, my registry rewards. So there was no digital for that one. I think it was for the other scent or there are two different like non-drowsy and then there's another one. I think that $8 one might've went for that one. Not absolutely sure. I was sure I seen the picture, but either way that left myself to $31.99. I paid $33.80 after tax getting back $40 in Walgreens cash plus 50 everyday coins. Subtracting that $40 in Walgreens cash from the $31.99, that left $5.99 moneymaker. Um, plus I did submit my receipt to Ibotta and I'm gonna collect for that. And for the Olay, I did not get back a registry reward or points. So they gave me $4 in Walgreens cash for the Olay. This purchase, the Allegra plus the Olay, a $9.99 moneymaker. I didn't even account uh, the $10 back on Ibotta. If I count that, $19.99 back. Fantastic moneymaker, $19.99 moneymaker. And then look what printed out, $4 off of Allegra. How bogus is that? And I had clipped all of the Allegra coupons. Something should have attached. Here's everything I'm picking up for today. Not bad. Um, not what I expected, but still a great day. $19.99 moneymaker for the spin deal. Cheap deodorant and detergent for that cotton nail. I still have to call customer service and get my $4 of Walgreens cash for that four off of two digital. I even had the three off of two digital clipped, nothing attached to the cotton nail. How crappy is that? Not even a uh, rebate on fetch for that cotton nail. So I don't know what's going on, but um, you know how they gave you a free, a few rebates back on fetch. Now I'm back to what I, what I used to be, nothing. One account gets a few, and then my account gets nothing. I'm back to the bogus deals on Fetch. But not a bad week at Walgreens. It's just that most of the items are giving back cash rewards. So you have to work them just a little bit different. And seeing how most of the items are giving back cash rewards, just roll your rewards. I didn't roll a lot of rewards because on the account I was using today, I'm starting trying to build up my cash rewards. And as you can see, when you build up your cash rewards, you do it at a price. But at least I can say out of the $33 I spent, I did get back $10 in cash. 
I bought a money count as cash. So that brings my total out of pocket cash wise to $23, which is definitely not bad, especially for that Allegra. And we definitely use that. But I'd like to thank you for joining me for another video and I will see you in the next one. Till then, peace.